Thank you, Doug. It's a privilege and honor to be here in the Bay Area. Uh, first, I'm going to start off, thank Lawrence Fan for driving us up to here. Lawrence is starting his 34th season in college football, San Francisco native. So I uh, always enjoy my time with Lawrence and a, a true asset at San Jose State. Two players came with me uh, today. I want to start off with a senior wide receiver, a 2012 captain out of Crenshaw High School in Los Angeles, Noel Grigsby. Noel, stand up. All right, and uh, on the other side of the, the ball, a defensive lineman, a, a junior to be uh, from College Park High School in Pleasant Hill, Travis Rossiti. Great. Uh, as mentioned earlier and alluded, uh, I'm from the Bay Area, so this is real excited, exciting time for me coming back home. I think one of the assets of that is I know and I appreciate the rich tradition of football in the Bay Area and not even venturing into the player part but from a coaching standpoint. Um, what we have at uh, San Jose State with uh, Coach Vermeil, part of our history, Coach Bill Walsh, a part of our history, uh, just to name a third of many more, Bob Latticer uh, across the Bay, uh, what he did at De La Salle, probably three of the greatest coaches at the professional and the high school level are from the Bay Area, Cal and their rich history, Stanford and, and their rich history, uh, and then going back, Santa Clara with Buckshaw, Terry Malley, uh, St. Mary's, and what they did in the 20s and their great teams, USF and their undefeated seasons in the 50s. So this is a rich, rich uh, gathering of football, and it's concentrated. And, I, and you'd be hard-pressed to go around the country and find a, a more concentrated and better group of, of football and from coaching standpoint than what you've seen in the history of the Bay Area. And to me, it's real exciting to be a part of that. Real exciting. It, it, it took a lot to come home. Um, we had a nice situation uh, where we were, but a chance to come home and be a part of this program that's on the uprise that uh, finished with a nice season last year, uh, a top 25 ranking, and carry some of that momentum into the upcoming season. Um, our players know. Uh, we talked about 2012. We know the history of our program. There's been some challenges. Uh, there have been some great times, too, as alluded to with, with the coaches and, and, and the players that have been in our program. One season doesn't mean you've arrived. We know that. Uh, back in January, our first team meeting, I addressed entitlement and complacency. Those are two cancers in a, uh, in a program that can nip a successful program from continuing on. They understand it. They have taken to heart uh, the plan, the strategy for continued success. And, and, uh, uh, and I just can't wait to, uh, to get things started uh, going for us. Um, the, uh, uh, the players are, are, like I said, had a great summer and worked hard and, and, and did so. My philosophy as a coach, being an ex-quarterback, I do love to throw the football. But truth be known, I want the heart and soul of our football team to be in the trenches. I want the offensive linemen to have that demeanor, creating movement and a physical style of play. And I want our defensive linemen to get after the quarterback, put pressure on them, and, and stop the opposing uh, run. So a little bit of, of my philosophy. Um, I, uh, uh, I, I'm really excited about leading this program as we go forward. Uh, I talked about into the, the Mountain West Conference, but with that comes a, a bigger challenge. Uh, San Jose State is stepping up and, and we know there'll be more challenges across the board in the Mountain West. And with that, uh, I want to reach out to our alums, San Jose State alums. I want to reach out to the San Jose community. I want to reach out to uh, the South Bay area, the Silicon Valley. We need you. Our program needs your support. Our program needs you in Spartan Stadium. Our, our, our team is uh, Spartan strong. And we need the, the San Jose community to be Spartan proud and come out and support this football team. We've got some guys that can make some plays. We've got a team that plays hard. Uh, and I'm excited to, to lead this pride. More importantly, the culture of our program, more importantly than wins, is excellence. Excellence in the classroom, excellence when we go out in the community, and excellence on the practice field. Because as to quote John Wooden, who's had a big uh, influence on my life with my background you take care of the process the desired end results usually comes and our team is going to be a process oriented team day in and day out we'll battle we'll compete and then you know come saturday chips fall where they may be but we're going to play hard and, and get after it 
but real excited about this opportunity. I want to thank everyone for putting this day together. It's a chance to, to further brand our name, our program. Uh, we're going to be on national television six times this year. That's more than San Jose State's ever been on national television. So it's a great uh, platform, great stage for people to, to learn about Spartan football and uh, what we do. But thanks again for inviting me. It's good to be here.